Hello, good afternoon. Just wanted to um, get out today because happy 1,000 kilometres on my new wheel day. Cool. That's gone really quick and I've had a blast. But while we roll today, I thought I'd just, you know, quickly gloss over the first 1,000 kilometres with the Inmotion V13, my experience with it, how the muscles are going, how the legs are going, um, how the wheel's going. So I kind of started editing a video which was just a, a looking back at some of the adventures I'd had on this wheel so far. Um, the 1000 kilometers has gone really quick because I've been so stoked about the wheel. I'm on it as much as I can. And I've really pushed through those first 1000 kilometers. We've got some footage running here, which is the old trails. You know, I've put it through its paces, down some stairs, a few jumps. I've done some speed runs had a nice crash, you know, all these things that it's held up to really, really well. It's still rolling beautifully, gave it a clean, I gave it a good look over, all the bolts, everything's in the right place, there's no shakes, there's no weird noises, and you know, every time I go and just charge it, turn it up and get rolling, it's, it's ready to go, and I'm just as stoked every single day to get back on this wheel. But I've kept a good eye on my wheel, I've looked at it, um, looked over, all of the you know nuts and bolts are all holding tight there's no vibrations there's no weird noises nothing's started to happen in the bearings i've um, cleaned everything up and added a little bit of dry ptfe lube onto the sliders just sprayed it up there i jumped on a few um, wheels last week i managed to get the chance to roll on the sherman s um, a, a t4 uh, what was it a m104 a king song 14d um, and yeah, back onto this, and, and they were all just as, you know, all great wheels. A every one of them had their own qualities, but I was really, really stoked to get back onto the V13. Everything else just felt a bit lighter, and I guess they are, but now that I'm used to this weight and what it can do, and the speeds, for me, it's like everything I want. And it does feel like a little bit of a step backwards if I'm going for something else. Mostly that speed, I'm so used to be able to push it up now. And, and rely on that safety margin when I hit the speed without any beeps or worries. Um, that's great. So I've still got a lot of room to grow into this wheel. And that's something that I'm really looking forward to. I haven't mastered it at all. And I love that, you know, at a thousand kilometers, I've still got heaps of room to grow with it. So we're still gonna have heaps more adventures. And that's cool, you know, I, I get a buzz out of that. kind of had wheels for a little bit now I had the V11 and I've put 10,000 kilometers on that and that was a real impulse buy I jumped into it and kind of needed to get rolling and I wasn't a big scooter fan at the time so I wanted something different grabbed the wheel and off I went and I was just thinking about this second wheel to have a second one I guess it kind of is a bit more of a lifestyle choice I think if you're investing and committing to have two wheels one as a backup or one for a different need it's a real statement about what this sport or hobby has kind of given me. It's really a new lifestyle. It's not just a way to roll. It's given me so much. The video channel, networking. Went off to a group ride the other night and you know, there's a bunch of amazing guys, all like-minded, the same buzz, rolling around on really cool wheels and just being able to chat shop and talk to a bunch of guys that are as crazy as you rolling around on one wheel it, it makes you feel feel really cool to be a part of this new thing so i guess the wheel is not only transport for me it's a way to hang out and meet people and you know this channel connect with all of you guys and, and you feel really good to be a part of that or anything so that's a bonus that came with this wheel but getting into my second wheel i think you start to really think about what the wheel is for and, and what your needs are more than just transport you know, I wanted something that had the range, had the speed, and had the weight to really give me a bit of a workout. And I wanted to grow into it, so that V13 has hit the needs for me. But I kind of didn't expect to be able to take it to the trails and be able to have a good speed run and have a good commute, you know, and all the things that I've been able to do with it makes it really versatile for me. 
the suspension holds up I think it's really comfortable and yeah the overall the wheel I'm, I'm absolutely really really stoked with the purchase I do still find a gap in my wheels I really want something for the trails I want something to be able to jump I am a big in motion fan and you know I guess I've grown up with them being the brand that has really supported me just the wheels work they still work my v11 still rolls flawlessly v13's rolled flawlessly so i'm the big in motion supporter on the channel and i'm pretty excited that i'm starting to be able to chat with the team there at in motion and you know get a bit of insight and hopefully offer some information back and they've let me be able to let you know you know they're working on a trail wheel which is super exciting it's not too far away i'll be able to find out a bit more information but i can at least give the name today he said that's okay so it's going to be called the adventure and yeah it is a dedicated uh, trail jump wheel so at this point it's going to be really exciting moving forward um, i'm already starting to save because for me i think that's going to hit the spot i know that i trust the brand it's got the support that i want and i know that they're innovative they're thinking of things so pretty excited to see um what they do with that wheel and you know a few other things just around the corner i think they're just doing amazing stuff and are really supportive so a huge thumbs up to in motion and that's going to be really really exciting so yeah the adventure is the the name they've given me for their next wheel um, and yeah should be able to drop some more information soon so that that's cool but yeah look back to the wheel um, this is just a quick run around my local streets I went down to a local alleyway just wanted to tick over to the thousand kilometers and try to capture it on camera and I was stoked to actually get it as it rolled over I just stopped and looked down and it said a thousand kilometers so for me, that's a really, uh, I guess, a milestone that I can look at the wheel and start to really feel confident. I know that I've gone through enough kilometers to really get to know its personality, get to know how to start to dial things in and start to be able to trust it. I know that it hasn't had any hiccups and isn't about to dump me off or cut out. So I think if you travel a thousand kilometers with anything, any person, you get to know a, a few of the quirks and you can then work better with that thing so i'm really at that point now where i actually love getting on it still and look forward to it and try to make the time because i've still got so much more room to grow with the wheel and i'm really trying to push my skills it's making me a better rider i can quickly step onto any other wheel now and just i can hold the weight no problem and i know i can manage the speeds that the other wheels are doing so absolutely making me a better rider and uh, I'm, I'm really really buzzed so I'm going to recommend this wheel to anybody that uh, is is looking at it but it might take you a bit to get used to with that weight and especially if it's your first wheel it's going to take a lot of work so good luck good luck to anybody that's just invested in it and hey if the weight is too much for you no dramas there's plenty of other really good wheels and you know a really nice in motion wheel on the way soon so uh, exciting times to be in the wheel world exciting times to wheel um, and exciting times to chat to you all so cool i'm buzzed i'm gonna run off go for a roll right now and um, let's chat next time i'll talk to you soon thanks for watching bye
things back. 